we're here at the Laser Blast booth with Al Keeping and uh, his team. And Al, tell us a little bit about Blazer Blast and what's new for you guys. Well, we have a new product this year. Uh, and speaking amongst ourselves, we realized there was a real need for a game that was simple, didn't need a computer, could be used um, with inflatables. Um, so we came up with a game called Basic Blast. And oh, yeah. Basic Blast is right here. And the wonderful thing about Basic Blast, you take it out of the box, you hit a button, and if you see over there, the game starts automatically, right. and you're playing laser tag. Right, cool. It's, it's very basic, uh, cost savings, but down the road, if you want to upgrade to the full radio game, all the equipment still works. You just add the computer and the other requirements. Oh, very interesting. So it's kind of an entry level, just if you want to get going, get a maze bill, get some revenues generated, and then add to it as you go. Exactly, exactly. Or if you have inflatables, and you want something that's easy to take out on site, plug in, start the game, it's perfect for that. And does it come with a certain amount of vests, or can you just pick a minimum of four? Uh, and up, up to 20. This goes up to 20. So from, I think typically in the inflatable market, maybe 10 is uh, a normal system. Right, right. And um, is that something then that would run score sheets as well? Is it all, is yeah. it that? Is yeah. We have, um, you don't, other than not having the targets and so forth at the, in the advanced game formats, we have score sheets that print out very quickly on a receipt printer that all the kids get a score sheet and we even have a uh, scrolling LED sign because it is a radio controlled game, the scores show up in real time. Cool. And, um, um, keep that going, I, got, I had a question that lost my mind there. Oh. And, and you don't find that with the targets uh, not available, kids are missing that at all? Uh, not at all. In fact, uh, you know, one of the things that we observed was in most games, where, especially when the kids are going to a birthday party and it's the first time they played, the, the arena gizmos, the targets and bases, the kids are unaware that they're even there. So uh, they want to go tag each other, and that's exactly what this does. You can do solo games or team games as far as the scoring goes. Well, very innovative stuff. So again, we're here at the Laser Blast booth with Al Keeping and his good team. You can check them out online at uh, www.laser-blast.com. There we go. Thanks for your time.